What's going on guys, Kai here, and uh, we're going to be talking about the Halloween event for Eternal Evolution. Right here we have a Facebook post I wanted to point out. Now first, uh, let's check out the actual event. So you get candles by doing uh, pretty much any of the PvE content. You can get 10 per day. It's a 15 day event. And uh, on the very first day it was launched, we got uh, two codes for five uh, candles each. I will have those codes uh, in the description if you have not gotten them. And uh, when you light candles, you, you also get rewards back. So this is reskinned to be like in a straight line versus the fuel event, which was like a gas thing. It's the same event. And we'll talk about the math in a second, but uh, this uh, skin might not be out of reach as some people think. And let's check it out. Not going to pay attention to who posted, just the post itself. Sadly, another pay skin. Max free to play can achieve is 140 points. Right there, second line, already wrong. Uh,. It's a 15 day event. Even their post right here says 14 days and 18 hours. So if you do everything today, that's 10. And then you have 14 more days to do that every time. So that's 150, not 140. Uh, it takes 220 to get the skin. That's true. Uh, so one must buy the $50 Halloween pack. Uh, half price compared to the Leo skin. That is true. But still not worth it. For a bunch of pixels in a game. Which at this rate. Which at this rate with devs making these kinds of monetization uh, design choices. May not be around long. As a Dolphin player, I've been a strong supporter of EE since its inception. That means he's played both of the Fuel events, so he's seen this exact event twice. And in both Fuel events, if you did the dailies and used all the codes, you got the Chase item for free. In the very first uh, Fuel event, you can check at Dan Hellman's channel, because... Uh, 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 he was playing at that time that was to get Bailey you got a copy of Bailey when Bailey was pretty much one of the strongest units in the game the most recent one we had was for a trophy that reduces uh, cost uh, to do rerolls on uh, commanders by 80% and uh, that if you did the codes you got that for free so all it's just if you pay the um, $50 for this, then you get it a lot sooner. Uh, but seeing skins held behind a significant paywall instead of re uh, rewarding people for loyalty and playing the game, that's actually exactly what they're doing. Uh, loyalty and playing the game. You have to be checking the social media to get the codes, uh, which uh, are linked in this event the with the little uh, Fado or whatever his name is, the little one-eye guy. Uh, it has the Facebook link and the Discord link and says there will be rewards. That's the codes and things like this. Uh, and then you have to log in every day. That's This is kind of the strategy. Uh, they get to boost their metrics by you logging in every day. And if they can make you log in every day with a really good login reward, like with the anniversary or this, where you have to log in every day and be checking their social medias, that's win-win for them. They give you the other stuff as a throw-in. I do agree with him. Uh, we have talked about this where, let's say, the new Nord skin, $100, definitely not going to throw away that kind of money for that. If it was 5 10 something like that, people would... Uh, talk about it now let's check out some of the comments on this post looks like there might be a lot of codes though 
Two today added 10 more. They did this once before with the fuel event. Uh, not a lot of people played the first fuel event. Uh, I think that was actually technically in beta. Uh, where there were enough codes to get the big item for free. Now, let's talk about the math, right? It's 220 points to get the skin. You get 150 out the gate by doing the 10 per day. So you need 70. They give us 10 on day one. So we need 60. There are, uh, what was it? Uh, 14 days, uh, 14 days left. If every other day we get 10, we're good to go, right? Uh, so just do what they did and, uh, it might not even be 10. It might be different amounts to equal the same amount at the end, but we've seen this exact thing. Next one. They'll give codes to make up for the lack of summons, I'm sure. Uh, this is also, um, I'm familiar with uh, this guy's name. Uh, he's normally a downer. He normally, uh, you know, uh, sky's falling. Normally a guy that says that uh, everything posted is bad. Uh, but right here, he's aware of how these events work in this game. Uh, I'm not picking on the original poster. Uh, I've seen several of this same sentiment. And I just wanted to clarify what's going on, what's happened in the past. Maybe I'll eat crow uh, if they don't give us the codes. But everything we've seen from the past points towards you're getting that Rickert skin. Until next time, guys.